Hey y'all, this is Mike and Mark Mangum with Twin Blends Photography. We are so excited to bring y'all what we're fixing to bring y'all. Tell us a little bit about it. Oh, I thought you were going to do all the talking. <laughs> I'm like ready. Anyway, we are at Ford Park today. As y'all can see, we're behind, uh, in front of the train here at Ford Park. And what we have is pretty incredible. So we had a, a guy, okay, backstory. The guy. Make it short. Yeah, he's okay, telling okay, me to okay, make it okay. short. Okay, backstory. This guy emailed us and told us that he was looking through his mom and dad's old home movie collection and came across some zoo pictures and, and some other stuff. And he had no idea where it was at because he lives in South Louisiana and his mom and dad couldn't remember where it was at. Well, he did a little research on DNR because he saw a DNR train in the video. And so he, all he could find was Shreveport, Louisiana, but he couldn't find anything about a Ford Park Zoo or a train or anything like that. So he did another Google search and he saw our video on KTBS with Patrick Dennis the, when we were out here that day doing a story on Ford Park Zoo and Storyland and it hit him. This yeah. is exactly where it was at. And what it is, his dad and mom in 1966 visited Ford Park and Hamill Zoo and we've got both of those on video and Barksdale Air, Bar Bar Air Force Base it shows it the 1966 1966 it shows a clip of going through the front gate with a guard and then it, it shows going in there you'll see a big rocket and right now I think there's a bomber in that little what do you call it roundabout or whatever yeah. but it's a big huge rocket that was back yeah, there his in dad 66. was stationed there in six from 62 to 66 and so, so anyway on the video it, it shows you know you can see uh, Clark as a I think a four-year-old and his, his uh, uh, sisters like one years old but anyway it's so cool because it's a glimpse back in time and as he was researching he realized the significance yeah. of that home video and he said if he would have not seen our Ford Park video that video would have been lost forever it would have just been in the closet and gathering dust yeah we took the video and we digitized it yep. and we're gonna send him a copy of the full thing for his collection so we can have it on video yeah we did but we're bringing it to y'all also yeah we've been holding this it's been about a month and we're so excited and we wanted to bring this to y'all because we love what we do and that right there a film it's got a two and a half minute clip starting off of Barksdale Air Force Base, then a two and a half minute clip of Ford, I mean, Ford Park and Storyland. Story it's got the Storyland figures, Old MacDonald's Farm, you can see the peacocks. Yeah, all the stuff that we've had pics, found pictures of in the past, black and white, yeah. we've, we've got video of it. Yeah, and then we end up at Hamill Zoo, and guess who's there at Hamill Zoo? Tell them. Uh, the hippopotamus? The hip, hairy hippopotamus <laughs> and also the elephant Lima, Lady, yeah. Lady yeah. Lima, which yeah. is Hamill, Hamill spelled backwards, yeah. but they caught that on video too. And this is so incredible because this is part of Shreveport's past that yeah. would have been lost forever. Yeah, so. we just love it. When he sent us this, we were so excited. We could not wait to get out here I and mean, make a video. It's one thing to see pictures, but when you see yeah. video, color video too, yeah. of the old lady, old lady in the, the shoe. shoe. Yeah. 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 yeah, and the monkeys in the little round cage. Yeah. Everybody remembers Hickory, the monkeys. Hickory dock. Yeah, 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 so. yeah. But anyway, stay tuned to this video. Check it out. Like us on Facebook, share the video, share it to anybody that likes history. Yep. And, and tell us your stories. Tell yeah. us your stories about the time y'all came to the places. Ford Everybody Park, has Hamels. stories of Ford Park and Hamels yep. and stuff like that. Even the people stationed at Barksdale, they'll, yep. they'll probably remember some of this. So, yep. And just remember, at Twin, Twin Blend Blend Photography, the, the past, past and present are, are about to collide. collide. Oh, and we want to thank Kenneth and Carolyn Alton for filming this back in 1966 because this saved a little bit of Shreveport history for everyone to see. And we want to thank their son Clark for sending the video to us and entrusting us to show it to everybody to bring a little bit of Shreveport history back to life.